We'll move on to the item four in your agenda packet bids, contracts, agreements, and expenditures. Consideration of a request for payment of emergency sewer system repairs on Patterson Street near Drexel Park. The request was postponed on an October 21st meeting. It will be now revisited by David Frost, our fantastic utilities director. Thank you. Uh, good evening. Uh, this is, uh, as the mayor said, an emergency replacement sewer main at uh, Patterson Street near Drexel Park. Uh, on July 28, 2021, a city utilities crew responded to a report of a sinkhole at Drexel Park near Patterson Street. Uh, following the investigation, they discovered a section of the 24 inch concrete main had collapsed. Uh, the collapse of restricted sewage flow increased the risk of sewer backups and overflows. To prevent further collapse, staff quickly contacted the local contractor who requested emergency bypass pumps and to repair the sewer line. Subsequent research also showed that uh, the entire 422 linear feet of aging main was deteriorated and in danger of collapse. That's the section of main that runs under the Patterson Street uh, across the creek over the VSU property. Uh, this, this particular main was actually uh, identified for a future replacement projects. Uh, a full repair of the collapse section was considered, but staff ultimately determined the best course of action to expedite the replacement of the entire main. Uh, due to the time constraints and the critical need to prevent further pipe failure, an emergency condition was issued for repairs that prevented the use of the formal bidding process. Uh, RPI Underground was selected based on their availability and immediate access to the pipe and materials. Staff requested various options for replacing the main and determined the most feasible and less intrusive way was the Jack and Moore option. Uh, the contractor submitted design plans, ordered materials, and, and broke ground in mid-September. As of today, the project is complete. It is finished up. Uh, there's still some tape over there to around the new, newly born concrete sidewalk. But uh, for all intents and purposes, the project is complete. Uh, our guy submitted a quote of $562,384 in 10 cents for the work. Uh, we request approval of payment to RPI in that amount. Any questions? Yes, I will or bill. It's a, a, a bill. I'm sorry. It is a bill. All right. Any questions, Council? I have a question. Okay. I, I'm just asking, you know, because we had some pipes that were decaying and were put down. I don't have a problem with this amount, but we said, can we spend it out? You know, we can pay them for this amount here, but what I'm saying is, we, if something has happened within the next 30 days, then they have to go back in and repair. So we just make one, so we can make one motion on, on this repair because it looked like we delayed it a couple of times. Yeah, it was delayed the first time because we we projected it to be complete the entire right. last council meeting, but they had some things come up and we slowed up the progress of the so it took a little longer. So that's why it was delayed this time. But the, the entire 422 foot section had been replaced with PVC. Um, we don't foresee there would be any risk of any further collapse at this point. Maybe further downstream where some of that old pipe hasn't been replaced yet. That's also been identified for future replacement. Okay, that's, that's all I was saying. I just know, I know we, we, we want to pay our bills, but I just don't want us to come back for this project again because I just want to make sure that we're doing what we're supposed to do. And I want to make sure the contractor is held responsible for what, what it is that they're supposed to do. I don't want to come back two weeks from now saying that we need to look at another 10 feet. That's that's what that's the only reason I'm asking. Yeah, we yeah, we won't be doing that. So they, they did an inspection as they were doing the replacement and the, the pipe downstream from the manhole that they tied into over the VSU property is in good enough shape to hold us up until we get to the replacement project. Okay, with that being said I have to make a motion we uh I have a question. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, the reason I ask, I'm asking a question now, you said that uh, they were working in that area, and there was the area going on, uh, among the Patterson Street going to the Dallas State University that they already set aside that need to be done in the future. So you said additionally that that was the area we were going to fix those pipes? Correct. On that side. Okay, so with that amount of money that we had allocated to fix those sites, that, was in, that, that money was also included in this, Amount. I'm just, I heard you say, well, we went back and we fixed the pipes, so much of the pipes. Mm -hmm. So those pipes that they did fix on the VSU side, 
Uh, that all of the pipes that we had already, additional pipes that we were thinking about doing? That was part of the, the, the section of pipe, yes, ma'am. So it's part of it, so it's not all of it. It's not the entire section of it, no. There's that, that, that main road to, uh, all the way down to, uh, well, to the Burlington area, that, that particular 24 inch main. So they're going to come back again doing some more food. Yeah, next time we do it, uh, we'll hopefully have planned for it. And uh, a, little bit, a little bit better situation will be an emergency repair type situation. So, so why do they have to do So this is part of the emergency, that part that they did. Correct. Yes, that is, we're, we're real concerned about the, condi the condition of that immediate pipe for us to create the number of the issues. So. And, and the remaining pipe? And the, and the remaining pipe. The remaining pipe is in good enough shape that we won't hear from them in the next month, maybe. We hope not. We hope not. But we've been having a lot of deals with our people. But you did explain to us that some of that money was coming from Splash and et cetera. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Last Tuesday, you, I mean, Tuesday, I think it was Chuck or Mr. Collins explained that about all the money. So some of it was coming from Splash and et cetera. So it's not like it's all coming out of Osborne and, you know, yeah. out of the city. Yeah, my, my understanding is it's coming from Splash and as soon as you set aside for these types of That's what I heard you that it's all Our staff that discovered the issue. Correct, yeah. And RBI was able to mobilize and respond to the, the issue and, and begin the repairs. More importantly, getting the bypass pumps going because we had otherwise we're going to have suits built. Correct. That that was that was the main concern when we finally discovered what what had happened with the collapse was getting that section of main bypass so it wouldn't create a further collapse maybe even under the, under the roadway great problem there as well. So they they were the RPI had the bypass pumps readily available for able to bring them out that day. So they they were chosen simply because they were the only firm that could respond quickly enough to address the issue. Correct. They were already working on the question for the district state they were doing a uh part of the drive part of the water. Yeah, they have, they have they have on that Right. And just to give you an eyewitness account, it just happened to be pulling into the BSU parking lot when their entire army crew came flying in with that pipe with those bumps. I was with that guy. David got a phone call from me. Said, "What? What the world?" <laughs> the whole world descended on the park almost instantly. It was, it was pretty impressive to see. It was a great response by them. Much appreciated. All right. Any other questions for David? Thank you. No. All I was saying is for full transparency, so people will see that we're not picking and choosing country. That's why. I, that's why I made that. That's why I asked that question. Now. You may I'll accept the motion. I'd like to make a motion. You keep talking. That we approve. You keep talking. I have a motion. It's repair. It's emergency repair for five hundred sixty-two thousand three hundred eighty-four dollars in Tennessee with the contingency. Second. Um, back up. No, no, no. There's no contingency. Where is the contingency? Where is the contingency on that? I mean, why do you want to do that? Where is the contingency? No, 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 no. Okay, we'll 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 die to the contingency. Five hundred sixty-two thousand three hundred eighty-four dollars in the Perfect. I have a second. Second and a second. All in favor, show the hands. Yes. 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 Yes.